All right, yo, what's up, guys? Rylex back here with another video, and today we're playing Modern Warfare. Um, kind of different because I played Warzone, but not Modern Warfare. Uh, recently, at least for any videos, I don't think I haven't. Have I even made a video on Modern Warfare in a minute? I don't know. I honestly forget because I think I recorded one, but I didn't upload it. Okay, I played Warzone, and I played. Oh, and I played World War II. I knew I played something. Yeah, we haven't played Cold War in a minute, that's what I was... Because I was like, I haven't played Cold War for a video uh, in a minute. But anyway, I really need to fix this fan because it's just going to keep getting louder and louder. I don't think it was that loud with Vanguard. So hopefully I can just deal with it. I'm going to have to get like thermal pads and replace it. Because if I don't, then I don't know. Maybe I'll just get a PS5 eventually. I don't know. So yeah, I never really played Modern Warfare like seriously. Like I played it a couple times and then that was pretty much it. I mean... I played it a little bit during, um, like, quarantine and everything, just because that was the only game that was out. As far as Call of Duty, the recent one, before Cold War. But yeah, I definitely got into this game right before Cold War came, and then it was just kind of too late, because Cold War was already out before I knew it, and it's kind of how Vanguard is. Um, you know, I'm not by any means saying that I don't want Vanguard yet, or I would want to postpone it if I have the ability to. You know, if I was able to, like, freeze time right now and play this, I'd rather just play Vanguard, I think, because I really, I do enjoy the movement. It was just something that was different, and Cold War was a little bit, it felt a little bit more natural, where it's just had a little bit of a learning curve to it. I like Warzone, and, you know, it's nothing against this. It's just, the sniping at first felt really weird, and then I came back half a year later and I played, and I actually didn't mind it. And earlier this morning, before, well, actually, what am I saying this morning? It was like 2 p.m. But earlier, I was just testing stuff out, just seeing what I wanted to make a video on today. And I picked up this Barrett, this uh, right tech or something. And um, I hit a, hit a little bit of a, a thingy. Wouldn't call it a clip. I mean, it's a clip. It's just not a clip. You know, it's a split. And I, I just, I, uh, bruh. Bruh. getting a little actually <laughs> getting kind of decent that uh that, that little thingy that little clip it kind of sucked that i had my mic on because i had this elgato software open to make this video that i'm making right now you know i just wasn't recording yet it was warming up and uh i went ahead and grabbed the flashback maybe there's theater in this game i don't even know yeah i'm debating on playing this game for a little bit just because i'll still get my battle pass and everything but i'll be able to get more used to this movement and everything so then when it's time to play vanguard when it comes out in november obviously that that's kind of in the future um it's closer than it seems but it's like 58 days i think but yeah the beta is almost here it's only a couple days away uh for it to start and i don't know if i'm ready for it like and what i mean by that is like i'm i'm excited to see it oh, i just built my desk that's my bad if that was loud i'm excited about it but at the same time I know I'm gonna have to like really grind it out to feel satisfied in the end because I had access to play it and then I know once it's away I'm gonna feel I'm just gonna feel really bad about myself if I don't play enough because I didn't play enough of the alpha and then once it was gone I was like damn really wish I could have played that more but I could have I was just busy I will say like seeing old maps on this game it's nice, but it's also trippy because I didn't play this game all the way through so there's maps that are brand new to me guns that are brand new to me kind of especially the maps really that's like the main focus here like i get on a map and i'm like i do not remember but then i get on a map that i remember from an old cod game and i'm like uh the fuck <laughs> like it's just it's trippy because it's like this is so new this is so new wait this is old and it's all like mixed together in this weird way because even though it's an old map it's like there's subtle differences and just the quality's better so it's like it's new but it's not it's like recycled I don't know if that's a good thing or not. Let me know if you guys think it's a good thing down in the comments. <laughs> oh, damn. Hey, dummies, there's somebody up there. And there's two of them, I didn't know that. All right, yeah, so on that note, it's been your boy, Rylex. Um, let me know if you guys want to see Modern Warfare Warzone or uh, Cold War, like what your preference is, and I'll just kind of go by, you know, whichever one gets the most. That's the one I'll play more. Uh, 
I could also play World War II, but obviously those games contribute to the leveling uh, of this current game and the battle pass and everything. So I kind of prefer to grind that out because like I don't really feel motivated to grind out BO4 or um, World War II just because it doesn't it doesn't go towards it. So there's really no point. But yeah, peace. I'm a living fool, so ain't compromising half a million on the court.